you would say? What I do what? Nothing. No, what did you say? I wanted you to turn the bedroom light off. Oh, but you acted like a maniac running over here. Well, let me go. So, baby, I'm still trying to have fun with this cooking show. You may have gotten lazy, but I haven't. I, I, but I guess, you know, if I if I did it 50, 52 times and I never beat somebody else around the counter, I'd probably quit doing that. You're the only doing too. that now because you're winning. No, because you lost 52 times in a row and you probably just decided to give up now. No. Hey, everybody. Welcome to season two, episode number six, California Week, cooking with Dan and Lou. Yeah, all right. I was supposed to say California. Oh. We're cooking for California. <laughs> Woo! All right, <laughs> California. Uh, guys, I don't know if you can tell from what we got out here, but I mean, I think it's pretty easy to tell what we're doing today. Baby, you want to tell them anyway what we're doing? We're gonna make Baja tacos. Is that how what we call them? Baja, Baja fish tacos. Baja fish tacos. So Baja fish tacos. The thing is, we're here. You know, the family's gonna come over at seven and be ready to eat. It's five forty-five right now. And really, we got to do a few things to the coleslaw. We cheated. And we bought. We you bought, didn't have to tell them that. We, we bought we bad coleslaw, it. and we're going to doctor it with our own. It says add cider vinegar. Oh, I just don't know. We got and we're going to add stuff. some cilantro well, to we it. We got other stuff, too, here that Lou don't have out yet. So uh, What? Yeah, we got pico de gallo in the Oh, fridge. and we do have chipotle. We got chipotle sauce. sauce That's for fridge. on top of the tacos, though. Yeah, so we got other stuff. But anyway, guys, before we get started. Hey, look what we have on today. And before we start, Daniel tried to pull a fast one on me again. And you know how I know when I put it on? Because the neck of it hangs like way down here. I was like, this is not my apron. I tried to and adjust I looked, it. And I look, and of course, I tried, to, tried to adjust give me that it one. too. Uh, anyway, guys, we're fixing to get started cooking before we do. Listen, some of you guys got your feelings hurt because some of us did or didn't like the meal from your state. Okay, listen. And I know there's a lot of people that watch from outside the United States. We appreciate that. Thank y'all so much. But listen, guys, we're all Americans here, okay? You're not going to like everything I cook. I'm not going to like everything your state cooks. We're not being mean to your we're state. Not being, listen, we still like your state. We want to We want to travel every state. Absolutely. So we never... Buddy and Steph made a joke about Arkansas was trash and Alabama was trash. They were just God, playing. just jokes. Come They're on. Not, uh, not everybody's going to like your food. Not everybody's going to like our food. Not everybody's going to like the way we cook. But it's okay. We're all... I mean, you saw that when Pops wouldn't eat uh, the... <laughs> Pops ain't going to eat this tonight. Well, would he not eat the... The white barbecue sauce? No, the fish stuff. Salmon. Oh, the salmon. Salmon. Yeah. Yeah, Pops didn't eat salmon. Pops didn't eat the white barbecue salmon, sauce. Salmon, salmon. Pops is not going to eat these, not bar, these tacos. Again. But listen, don't get your feelings hurt. Seriously, we, guys, we're just having fun here. Mm -hmm. We're having fun. We're trying stuff from every state. Just enjoy it with us and have a good time with us. And if somebody says something about like, oh, that California dish was trash, we're just joking. We don't, come on. I've been to California a bunch. Um, who's never been? Um, yes, I have. Oh, you did go. Did go? it? Yes, she I've been to San Diego. I can't go anywhere that she don't try to yeah. copy me on. I've already been there. Anyway, guys, let's get to cooking. <laughs> Guys, real quick before we get started, we got new stove covers. Aren't they cute? Maybe. I even bought new little things. Did you buy new knobs so you won't turn on the wrong one? No. <laughs> Maybe I should put an F and an R front and rear. Because obviously <laughs> you say I don't know how to read that little thing. All right, guys. So listen, I want to say one more thing here real quick. Um, and I know we're going to get some flack for this. Okay. Sorry. I had to put the camera back in the holder. I know we're going to get some flack for this, but I know that different people, different places use different types of fish for fish tacos. Oh. We are going to use catfish because that's the kind of fish that everybody around here is used we to. We like, yeah. Um, you know, we could do some cod or something like that, but people's not going to be used to that taste. 
They may or may not like it. I don't know. So we're going to go with the fish that. Oops. We're going to go with the fish that we're all used to around here. We're going to batter it the way that we're used to eating the batter. And it's just going to be meat for a taco. Hopefully this works out well. So I'm, I think your dad would probably. I'm, I'm just worried about his dad not eating for some reason. I think since it's going to be catfish and it's he likes coleslaw, I don't think he understands. I think he will end up eating. The thing it is, if he, he doesn't like coleslaw, he'll, 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 he'll just eat he'll the fish, fish and he'll just eat plate. the coleslaw. Yeah, but what's the difference of putting it with the tortilla? Yeah, it's, well, the coleslaw. I'm figuring out. I'm not going to be a fan of coleslaw. I, I'm just. If we would have went to Captain D's and got coleslaw and put it on there, I'd probably like it, but I'm not going to like that. This thing. is basically the same thing. That's, no, let's put that in a blender and blend it up by like a thousand times smaller and put some mayonnaise or something in it and maybe it'd be close. What do you think the salt, this, look, this coleslaw even came with the sauce. Well, if you blended it up a bunch so, more, maybe it would be. Anyway. anyway, all right, let's get busy. What are we going to do first? We're gonna I'm gonna, the coleslaw I think first? we can get the coleslaw going so I can put it in the fridge. Okay, so... The cilantro I don't think goes in with the coleslaw. We're gonna put it as a We're separate topping. Oh, you want you don't want to mix it? I want to mix. I want to put it in with a se as a separate topping. Ooh, ooh. What is that kind of? What is that? This is the creamy sauce for the coleslaw. Can I can you smell it or anything? It's not open yet. This coleslaw smells good already. It's me. I love coleslaw. Can we take this and put it in our blender and just like... No, just we're doing it just... It, you're eating it on tacos. It's like a lettuce for the taco. It's cabbage. It, Urgh, it's cabbage. It's just a mental thing for you. You need to get over it. I don't I like cabbage. Oh. Well, I do like the other coleslaw. You could throw all this away. Okay. You like blended coleslaw. What's the dang difference? I don't know. There's, there, I want to smell that, please. Hold down for a second. I didn't realize it was that thick. Your mom was thick. Uh, you know, I'm going to see my mom in a couple weeks. I'm just oh, going to yeah. tell her what you're saying about her. Your mom loves me. She was never going to believe that. Ever. And I talk bad about her. I have one of those mother-in-laws that actually likes me. Because she don't live by you. <laughs> well, it's true. She doesn't live by me. But she knows I take very good care of her daughter. She does know that, yes. And my dad loved you too, because he knew you took good care of me. Yeah, I mean, your dad had just a lot in common. Yeah, me. <laughs> oh, Lord have mercy. All I right, need something to stir this up. Uh, you want one of these? <clears throat> no, just like that rubber spatula is fine in the oh. drawer. Sweets. All right. All right. We're going to add just a touch of this. You got to mix that sauce in a lot better. Like a cap full or what? I don't even know about that, but uh, yeah, just maybe like a cap full. This is your recipe, California. Well, sort of. One more cap? No, no. One more this, cap? No, it's strong just smelling it. No. One is plenty. You sure? Yep, I'm positive. <laughs> Ooh. Because we also have this Chipotle sauce. Taco Bell Chipotle sauce. I don't know if y'all have Taco Bells. We but Taco probably, Bell is like one of my most favorite places yeah, to Yeah, we eat. were probably supposed to make that. Well, we didn't. We cheated. <laughs> we're just going to make the fish and put it on a taco and call them Baja Fish Tacos with some coleslaw. Alright, this looks mm, smells good. Uh, does it? Let me yeah. smell. Let me smell. Let me taste of it. Mm, no, don't smell too bad. Let me taste. Okay. Mm -hmm. You gonna let me taste? Oh. Mm -mm. Okay. You don't like it. Well, you don't know that. I've got to learn to start trying to taste things, baby. All right, coleslaw's done. Let's get let's get on to part number two. I'm gonna cut some cilantro, yay! Mm -hmm. I'm not even gonna cover this. I'm just gonna stick it in the fridge. Cause we'll be using it a little. This is 
going to be what's... Oh, I have the lid right here. I guess I could cover it. I'll just sit it. I really think the cilantro is supposed to go in the coleslaw, though. I mean, look, if you want to put it inside the coleslaw, you want to put too. This is our pico de gallo we was talking about. We got it out a while ago. That's because Daniel wants it. And this is some green sauce that we buy from. I'm trying to talk. I'm not talking. You're, sl you're slamming that knife. Sorry. You want to put this in the coleslaw or not? Well, let me, let me look at what this said for the coleslaw because... All right, well, let me know what you want me to do. All right, so I got the coleslaw back out because I really feel like the cilantro needs to go in the coleslaw. And that's what her direction said. <laughs> I was trying to make them think it was my idea. You just read it literally on video. You read your directions. No, it was no video. video when I read oh, that. Oh, it wasn't? No. Oh, sorry. So you just gave my secret away. Sorry, babe. Just kidding. Y'all know that it wasn't my idea. I don't know about this kind of stuff. There you go, sweets. Oh, it looks so pretty, too. Tastes what? really good. I think you should get a fork and taste it. You think I should? Yeah, I do. Jesus, please help me. Jesus, let me finish. Let me. me get it mixed in really oh, good. Oh, Jesus, please help me. Oh, quit. Oh, Lord Jesus, help me. I got to pump myself up. You're for, being so dramatic. I have to pump myself up for tasting new things. I don't just, I don't just stick anything in oh my, my mouth. Oh, my gosh. We're going to be expert Baja taco makers. Come on. Eat it. Oh, Lord Jesus. I think I could just eat this by itself. I well, will. That's too much. I'm gonna, that's too much. No, that's too much. That's too much. You have a big no, mouth. Eat that's it. too. You have oh, a big Jesus. mouth. Eat it. Jesus, help me. Now, you got cilantro on your lip. It's not as bad as you thought. You worked yourself up for nothing, didn't you? Okay. No, he knows. He likes it. That's why he's being like that. Freaks itself out for no reason. Oh, it'll be better. It'll be better on talking with some meat, I can promise you. And not a bunch. Okay. The only thing we really have left to do now is cook fish. And I feel like it. We need to get it cooking. Why is this so warm? That's weird to me. It's kind of warm. Oh, you got hot water in the bowl. No, oh. I don't have any water in the bowl. That's just from the fish. Oh, we need to drain that. You need to drain I keep, that. I, you got to drain that, baby. I keep trying to drain it, and it just keeps coming back. Well, the problem is this is not Daniel Morrow caught catfish. Exactly. It's store-bought catfish, so we're hoping and praying that it's, it's going to be good catfish. Because we didn't want to go to the lake and get our catfish. We had fish at the lake, and I, we didn't we haven't been to the lake in a while. All right, buddy, you good? I'm good. Let's get some uh, let's get some heat. We need to get the grease going. Yeah, let's get the grease going. All right. Wait, I want to completely clear the stove. Yeah, you probably should do that. I was told... Always clean the stove off completely. You just told us this past week? Yes. <laughs> I'm doing what I'm told by everybody. All right, you do that. I'm going to continue to get this Are stuff you saving ready. this for something? Uh, yeah, I'll put it just in case. Put this bowl back in there. I guess you could put that. What time is it? Six? Oh, it's only five after six. Yeah, we got time. Well, that's okay. The absolute best fish fry you can buy, guys. Like I said, if we get done early, we're just going to call everybody to come now because we do have work and stuff tomorrow, and we can be done earlier yeah. than normal. Okay. Uh, do you have any of these? No, I'm going to put them on this front one right here. Front high. I don't, I don't like you to cook on the front one because grease gets all over the floor. Well, I don't like to go back over the back. Stone. And what are you going to put the fish in after it's done frying? Uh, Why'd you turn some... these over? I didn't do that. All right, let's get the seasoning. <coughs> you ready? 
a lot of water in that bowl. I, it's it's like not really water. It's like thick, weird, gross stuff. Okay, well, don't say that when we're fixing to cook. Well, I don't know. You're throwing stuff everywhere. I'm Why? Not on it good. Why is stuff flying everywhere then? I don't see anything flying. I did. I don't know what you've seen. I saw that stuff flying out of there. It's even all over you. Well, I don't know. Oh, man. your hat is. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> you can't Shouldn't you uh, fry that as you get it out? We can, but uh, we can't. We don't have to. You don't. You don't, you don't want to touch it. Mm -mm. No, that's what you're trying to get at. What do you need me to do? I mean, there's no sense in both of us doing that when you're. Well, right there. I don't know. There's, there's. This is a. Uh, that you're not putting the lid on it right. That's what's wrong. There you go. Stuff flying. You don't see that stuff flying out okay, everywhere? Well, I don't know why it's doing that. Okay, maybe don't be so dramatic with it then. Oh boy, this is going to be a mess to clean up. I can already That's why we typically cook fish outside. outside. Yeah. Uh, what was I fixing to say? Some, oh, this is 10 tacos right here. This is 10 big fillets right here. That's 10 tacos. I know. We shouldn't have used all of this. Fried fish will never go bad. So Somebody will take it home and eat it. Uh, you know that. You really can't reheat fish at work, so I can't take it for No, lunch. people eat fish cold the next day. Cold fish is awesome later on or the next day. You know what? All right, you do it. You see if anything comes out. I'm just going to do it a little more like this and not so crazy. Okay. Good? Mm -hmm. All right, guys, we are ready to cook some fish. Oh, I didn't get platters out. Our uh, grease is at 300, and that's, actually, our grease is getting a little warm. So, we're ready to get started now. Forgive that. There we go. And let's get ready. Try not to be crazy with the grease. Maybe. I'm going to try not to. Need so much for my brand new stove stuff. It's going to be all nasty. I'm probably blocking the camera view. I don't know. Like go. how long does it take per when it's floating? Batch? When it's floating, probably three minutes maybe. But when it's floating, it's good. That ought to bring the temperature down just a hair. If it doesn't, I'm going to turn the temperature down. I'm probably going to turn it down right now. Between 7 and 8. I just want to make sure it's not stuck to the bottom of that strainer basket. Well, should you get something? I will. I will get something. Okay, guys, we are looking good. Our temperature is still at 300. We're, I mean, it's keeping temperature perfectly. I do have my tongs just to kind of make sure everything is will float. I don't want it stuck to the bottom because the fish is ready when it's floating. And it's floating now, but we do like our fish. It's a little bit darker, so we're going to leave it in there just a little bit longer. Uh, we don't want anything tasty fishy, but we're going to get it a little bit crispier, how we like ours. Guys, I'm not going to make a grease mess and, and dump the basket. I'm just going to do this since we're in the house. I'm going to do this the cleanest way I can think of. And that's going to be pick up the basket and uh, take the fish out like so. Yeah, he knows what's best for him. <laughs> All right, baby, let's do a little taste test. What do you think? It's too hot right now.
That's good. Farm raised fish, there's a difference. You were blowing smoke just now when you talked. Well, I was having a hot fish. It's good though, it's not bad. It'll be, uh, be good on tacos. It's all right. With that coleslaw? Oh, I don't know about coleslaw. Mm -hmm. But it's gonna be good. It'll be good. We're actually just gonna taste it right here. All right, guys, we're gonna taste the chipotle sauce because I don't know what chipotle sauce tastes like. <coughs> I don't know Jesus help me. Lord Jesus, Stop help me. it. Ooh, Lord, help me. Oh, mm. it's just so good. Mm. Oh, it's really good. Uh huh, you like it. It's not horrible. I mean, he's so dramatic. Would y'all know that by now? I'm not dramatic. How am I dramatic? You just Ed, proved it to everybody on this camera. Just about pray a little bit before I tell you something that could be gross. <laughs> I don't want to throw up in front of everybody. That's dramatic. It's not dramatic. Yeah, that's dramatic. All right, guys, loose back. She literally went out there to feed the animals and she was out there for 30 minutes while I was in here. Oh, what a rough life being stuck in the kitchen. Because no, I LJ. Mind. What is the matter with her? LJ is stubborn. LJ is stubborn, huh? Anyway, we've already got people here, of course, and food's not quite ready, but almost. Uh oh. People can make their plates free. Steph, old Laramie over there. And, uh, of course, there's Cash. Carter and Alora are playing in the bedroom. And we're going to get ready for everybody else, guys. We're going to eat. Leva! You just walked by your Uncle Dan? Yeah. Didn't even give me a hug? Boy, you better go over here and give me a hug. Hey, what all you bring in my house? Huh? All right, guys, I want y'all to look at what Kim has in her hand. He used it. I did not use it, you I promise. You took the wrapper off I, and you tried to put the wrapper back on. No, I did on. not. Listen, Kim, I got that for Kim for Christmas along with something else. I don't remember how we forgot to take it over to G's or whatever we did yeah. that night. So it's been in my spare bedroom. Yeah. What and is it? It's a straight edge. You clamp it to your wood and then you... Run your saw down it straight and make a perfectly good cut. I'm not a real straight awesome. the length, the long length, I can't. He's yeah, good at it, guys. Whenever I ever have to make a big cut. He's yeah. awesome at long length, even with one eye. But I'm not. I'm not long. I'm not awesome at cutting long links. It just I can. She would rather me do it than her try to do it. Man, it's not because I'm awesome. Some... You are awesome, and your that... stretch is farther. And well, I, I appreciate you. No, no. Awesome is right I, now. no, no, it's one of those things where you know how you meet people and if you pat them on the back, they'll do anything for you. Like you tell them something good about themselves, they're like, oh, yeah, I'll fix your car for free. Don't worry about it. You know, because you told me you're a great mechanic. That's what she tries to do to me. Oh, you're so good at making cuts. So the thing I'm just going to run out and cut everything you got for. No, but I do got a job. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Whatever you got, I'm ready. I'm going to show y'all what I do to Cash. And he's, he, he, should, he should run straight underneath one of those chairs. He should run one straight under one of them chairs it's and hide. Funny, guys. Three, five, four, hurry, four. Hurry, hurry, hurry. I Get smell it. the blood of an Englishman. Oh. Three, five, four, four. <laughs> Boy, I got you pegged. All right, come on out. <laughs> come on out. I won't get you. Him and, him and Carter both, if I do that to them, they run and they get underneath those chairs like that every time. Okay, guys, we're going to pray. Okay. And then I'm going to give the rules. We're going to we pray. Go. Shh. Be quiet, let's pray. Shh. Come on. Okay, all right, Heavenly Father, thank you, thank you, give us, Lord. Thank you for all the things you've done for us, all that you've blessed us with. Lord, please bless this food, the nourishment of our bodies. Bring us all back next week, safe and sound. Thank you for letting everybody be here tonight. Jesus name, amen. 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 Alright, now listen. Dad, go see him. You're gonna have to try a fish taco. I'll make it for you. You take a bite of it, you don't like it? 
You toss it. I don't like my own, but I'll try it. Listen, okay. you like the fish and you like the coleslaw. It's just on a tortilla. It's basically. Try the fish taco. And if it don't, then you can have a few pieces of fish. I'm going to tell y'all right now, and I'm just going to be honest with you. This is not dang them all caught fish fresh from the lake. This is probably farm raised. I don't, oh, I think it's just fishy. What a toy, man. How dare but you make fishy fish? I know. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's dig it. Come on. What do you mean it's not farm raised? It's very it is good. farm raised. I think, it's a, I think it's a little fishier than like lake fish. You like the fish, Bubba? Uh, yeah. 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 I have tartar sauce too right there. Since it's ketchup, not don't want fish taco, Dad. I'm gonna have some. Yeah, I want ketchup. Hey, did you do that? Yeah, you got this. He's not gonna take a lot of the coleslaw, just so y'all know. Are you putting much on yours? No, I'm not. This is one. I would like to make a fish taco first. Take it out. Where's the book you dropped on your table? Oh, I am. She's not even doubting it. I know that I'm going to love it. Big that is good. <laughs> Did Buddy get on to you last week for not liking the food or what? No. <laughs> I said I was actually looking forward to this. How is it, Lou? You're in over eating. You like it? Good. Okay. Sorry. Laramie? Absolutely. I, I need not. what you got. Absolutely. No way. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, this is not finely ground. <laughs> This is a thick coleslaw. Well, I told you. But he, but you are having it on a tortilla, Larry. Okay. Oh, right I can eat anything on a tortilla. Wait, how about some pico de gallo? What are you looking for, bud? No chipotle sauce, Larry? I don't eat that stuff. <laughs> My goodness. I don't know what they gave the ingredients out of that thing. I knew I should have made I knew I should have made little penny fish tacos for everybody's taste the way they're supposed to be made. And then they make them on the plate. <laughs> what I should have done. You knew I wasn't going to eat that. Yeah, you're right. 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 All right, California. Huh? I love California. She wants to go to the Good job, you mm -hmm. are. Yeah, big taco's good. Mm -hmm. I really like it. Mm -hmm. I think with a better fish, it would have been pretty good, actually. Not bad, California. I'm impressed. We'll get everybody's final opinion here in a little bit. All right, everybody, here we go. Let's get started here with some reviews. And we're going to start with Elora. Wait a minute. Is it Elora or of uh, Laura? With an E? Okay. Elora. Did you eat a fish taco? You actually ate a fish taco? What all was on it? See, Laura loved the fish tacos. She asked her mom to make Was them. there coleslaw on it and everything? Did you like it? Awesome. Levi, did you enjoy your fish taco? I had something at home. Oh, you had you had something at home? Yeah. Oh, did you enjoy the tea? Yeah. Okay, good. Carter, did you enjoy your chicken? It was good? All right. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I gotta go in here in the private. Lou. What? Can you see me? I can't see this. Carter thinks she has a little fish. Her mama told her. It was fish. I mean, chicken. 
but it was fish and she loved it. <laughs> you're gonna, oh, you're having more chicken? The chicken tacos were awesome. Boy, that chicken is awesome looking, Carter. That's awesome. All right, Laramie, let's hear what you did actually do. I mean, I just Daddy, ate the, here, the fish, but yeah. I just think it was a little fishy, but it was all right. The, I said you the fish is a little fishy, too. But fishy. did you have it on a taco? I did eat it when I bought a tortilla. Was it okay? Yeah, I get a tortilla on anything, though. But you did not have the coleslaw? No, huh. absolutely not. I have something to <laughs> say. Well, okay. For people that did not like coleslaw, there is no two guys coleslaw left. Two guys left. Wow, that's a lot. I love the coleslaw. Well, I like the coleslaw. Right, yeah. All right, so Lou, let's go. We're already on you. Let's go ahead. You loved it? I loved it. Yes. You loved it. Stop. Hold on. Hold on. Pause. Wait, why? Okay, car. Wait. Car hey, stop for a minute. Stop for a minute. What's going on with you? Don't let her say it again. Hey, what did you just say? No. What did you just say? Tell me what you said. She's got an itchy booty for crying out loud. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> Woo. All right. Brian. Time for a warm bath. Brian. Yeah, time to take did a bath. you eat a true fish taco with the coleslaw and everything on it? Coleslaw and chipotle sauce, I believe, is what I had. And how was it? Delicious. I had one and I went back for a second one and I ate half of it before I got too full. But when you good. lived in California, did you ever eat fish taco? No. I never heard yeah. of a fish taco when I was in California. Oh that was 56 I did. years ago. <laughs> How many years ago, G? 56. 56 years ago when you lived there? I'm 57. <laughs> What's it fixing to be? I'm 57. I'm sure I did eat a fish taco in California, but I'm they're popular 56. everywhere now. Yeah. So it'll be 57. Yeah, All right, G. <clears throat> did you eat a true fish taco? No. Okay, what did you have? Yeah. I had two yeah. pieces of fish yeah. and I had some coleslaw and I had a tortilla on the side. Why don't you just put it all together, G? I couldn't make myself do it. Uh, okay. I guess he was okay. wearing his diaper. We, I think we all know what the answer is going to be. I, I, you know, you used to be such a man. I don't know what's happened to you lately. No, he hasn't. Not when it comes to food. <laughs> He's never been a man when it comes to food. That's what I did. Because I wanted well, you to be. Else, I yeah. wanted y'all to be happy. Hey, I, I took my taco. I put a piece Larry, of fish in it. That on good for him, please? I put some coleslaw on it. And I took one bite off it. And How then, was it? And then I didn't like it. And then I emptied it back out of my plate. And I ate the coleslaw. I loved it. I ate the fish. I loved it. With ketchup. <laughs> and the little taco shell just laid there. <laughs> but now, if you want me to go back and eat the taco shell, I can't. No, it's okay. Well, okay. oh, whatever you call it. Yeah. Poor little tortilla. All right, Steph. Well, Steph, wait a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm, I'm kind of worried about where we're going to be with you here. I mean. Well, I'm, I'm back on track. Back on track. Okay, thank and God. I had one with chipotle and coleslaw, mm -hmm. and then I had one with tartar sauce and coleslaw, and they were both delicious. Okay, awesome. Kimbo? I had a fish taco. Like How was, was yours created? Okay, baby. I'll give you some. Without coleslaw. Did you eat any of the coleslaw? Yeah, the coleslaw is good, but I didn't have it on the fish taco. I just had a taco. Why would you eat coleslaw but not try it on the taco? I, I don't understand. Something about it all being together. It's yeah. just something about it. It just do not make sense that fish taco is that tortilla. <laughs> Oh, Lord. Who said that today, Ellie? It's just a texture issue. Ellie was Ellie had all of his food at Kim's so today separated <laughs> out, and I said, Ellie, you're supposed to put that what was it soup, soup on top of those on top of the pasta. pasta. And he's like, oh, uh, well, sometimes it's just better like this. And he went ahead and he took a spoonful and he put it on top. And he ate that spoonful, and then I seen him dump the rest of his bowl of it on there, and he mixed it all together and started eating it. I said, you should listen to old dad every now and then. Yeah. Um, all right, guys, so I don't even know how to keep score here. I think the fish tacos were a hit. Uh, buddy would have liked them. You can count one for Buddy. But count one for Buddy. Buddy would have liked them. count one for Buddy. He wasn't here. He wasn't here. Did, anybody, like did anybody besides me think that the fish was a little fishy? Yes, it laid on the bottom. It laid on the bottom. That's what Kim always tells me is it mm -hmm. tastes like mud. 
When you get that extra fishy taste, yeah. it'll be a muddy cat. I just know so, that that fish tastes totally different than the fish that I catch at the lake, no matter what lake I go to. It's a little fishier. This here was. I think it's called farm raised. Probably right. Maybe it is more mud or whatever in farm ponds or whatever they grow that stuff in. But anyway, it's okay. Fish. Um, is it not considered a fish taco if you don't have coleslaw on it? Well, that's just most fish tacos. If you go order one somewhere, it's going to come with, with that on it. With coleslaw. With coleslaw on it, yeah. So, anyway. All right, guys. Me and Lou will be back in a minute to finish out. All right, baby. What do you think? It was good. That was that was good. It was easy. Um, we cooked fish in the house for the first time ever in our lives. And it was not that messy, no. but it's not something I want to do all the time. No, for sure. Um Man, we've it was always, not even smoky in here. No, we've always done fish outside, always. And we've done fish a lot, but uh, the first time we've ever done it in the house. But that pot is very deep. And with the grease we put in there, I think it, it wasn't splashing over the sides or anything. So it worked out really good. And yeah, it don't stink in here. So that's a good thing. Fish tacos, good. Good. Um, I think just, I mean, I don't know. My family's a little bit kind of strange, but... They eat the, they eat the coleslaw. They eat the fish. They would not eat it together. Mm -hmm. Mom, Kim, and Dad. Like they wouldn't put it on the tortilla. Yeah, but they, they ate the tortilla too. Well, oh, but Dad, Dad took one bite and he took the tortilla side. And he ate everything else. He didn't eat the tortilla on the side. <laughs> no. Oh, I, I knew he wouldn't. I he knew he would eat it like that. Anyway, but everybody else, it's I think, fine. you know, I mean, it wasn't, uh, it wasn't bad at all. Did you like the chipotle sauce? <sighs> I ate my I ate my fish taco with the. I didn't. I just I put my chipotle sauce on the side and dipped it. I put I my chipotle just, sauce uh, on it and I ate the first one, and it was okay. It, it was not bad. But when I went back and made my second one, I put fish on the tortilla. I put my pico de gallo on it and my uh, what's the green sauce called the, for the tacos. Salsa verde. Salsa verde on it. With no coleslaw. With no coleslaw. And it was amazing. It was amazing. So, I guess there's a bunch of ways you can make fish tacos if you make them yourself. If you order them from the store, I guess you got to, or the restaurant. I think the whole point of the fish taco is the coleslaw, though. That's the whole point of yes. it? Yes. The whole, well, yeah. I'm going to tell you right now, if I had made that fish taco and put Captain D's coleslaw on it, I'd have ate it no problem. No problem. It would have been awesome. Good. We'll have that for dinner one night. We'll just take some tortillas with us to Captain D's. Why don't we do that? Take some tortillas inside Captain D's and make our own fish Honestly, tacos. Honestly, we'll probably never make this meal again. And the only way we're going to have fish tacos is if we order them if we're out somewhere. Yeah, for sure. But, hey, that's a lot of meals that we've cooked, though. I mean, let's be honest. We've not, yeah, ever made well, them we're still again. Not, we're still not big cookers, even though we only cook Only on our cooking show. Only on our cooking show. <laughs> That's so strange. We have a cooking we show. Never we cook never cook what anything. we cook ever. We again. never cook anything ever except for our cooking show. Guys, listen, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, thank y'all for hanging out with us uh, and the family. And uh, next week is going to be Colorado. Colorado. That's got to be something cool in Colorado, right? I honestly have not looked up. I want to say barbecue for some reason. Maybe like some elk. No, just because or it's mule, Colorado. Or mule deer or something. We yeah. have that in our freezer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. We'll catch y'all later. See y'all next week. Y'all have a good one. Bye.